Машенька. Доброе утро. Мама. Speak the English. We need to practice. You said yourself. And do not call me Mashinka. But that is your name. Call me Molly now. Masha, I don't want you to forget where you come from. Hey. <laughs> you have a good day. You too, Papa. There's the Russian girl. Look at her scarf. She looks like an old lady. Look at her lunch. I'm so Most fish sleep on the ocean bed or swimming around in the water. Elizabeth, let's give somebody else a chance. Somebody I haven't heard from yet. Molly, do you know? The fishes sleep swimming in the water. Except we say fish, not fishes in water. Elizabeth, not water. good Molly. Okay. Now, how do fish hear? The same way we do? Do they have ears? Arthur? Hmm? Okay, now, go. Nice. Nice. Okay, good, next. I'm scared. Come on, don't worry. You know what the trick is? No. Not to be afraid, okay? Hands up, stiff. Right hand down. Kick this left back oh, no. over. There you go. And bingo. We're going to have to work on that one, okay? Yeah. Next. Ow. Okay? I'm fine. Okay, Molly, you're next. I bet Superwoman couldn't even get her legs over. Okay, now, go. Careful. Good. Good. Excellent. She just did it with one hand. Excellent. My daddy Let's says hand, all everybody. Russians are good at that stuff. Guess what? Peanut butter and jelly again. Again? Where's she from? Russia, I think. Look who's here, that Russian girl. Oh, yeah. Look what she did with the napkin. She tucked it in like a baby. <laughs> Gross. Ew. What do you think that food she's eating is? Cold ravioli. It's that Italian, not Russian. Now, write a sentence using the verb to catch in the past tense. Okay, everybody, leave your answer sheets on my desk on the way out. See you tomorrow. Thanks. Bye. Bye. I 
thought it was easy. Bye. 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 Hi, Molly. Having trouble? I can't remember if you spell catched, V's K or C. Molly, would you like it if we spend some extra time on your English? Yes, please. Can you come to school 20 minutes early tomorrow? Okay. And I'm going to give you some extra homework to do, too, all right? Da, I mean, yes. One, two. Bubble gum, bubble gum in a dish. How many pieces do you wish? One, a two, a three. Oh. Mm. Hmm. What are you staring at, big nose? We can never go back to Russia. Even if we wanted, we could not. But Marina and Alexandra are there, and I miss them so much. I hate here. At school, girls laugh at me. When I talk, they tease me. Don't worry, Masha. As soon as they know you better, they will all love you. Your teacher is very nice. To learn your English before school begins, very nice. Don't worry. Those girls will stop. You'll see. I never do nothing to them. Why do they make fun of me? Because you're different. But I'm not different. Masha, everybody is different. But they forget. Forget what? That everybody is the same too. One nose, big or small. One heart, big or small. Even those girls, they have heart. I don't think so. Maybe you should look closer. Sleep good. Have beautiful dreams. Good night, Papa. Lesson? Yeah. Da? Da. 
working. Okay. If you do that, that should help. What do you have in the Turkey, what else? The first thanks Thanksgiving? That's right. What is Thanksgiving? <laughs> the story will explain, Molly. Go ahead. Keep reading. When the brave pilgrims landed Girls, at be quiet. the mass, they faced many hardships. Go on, Molly. It was very cold and they soon ran out of food. Very good, Molly. Arthur? Me? Who else? An Indian named Squato. I mean, Squanto. <laughs> Settle down. Came to live with them and showed them how to play corn and where to hunt and fish. The pilgrims marked the end of their first year by throwing a huge feast of thanks with the Indians for their harvest. We still celebrate this day to honor the bravery of the pilgrims who came to seek religious freedom in the new world. Thank you, Arthur. How about making a model of that first Thanksgiving feast using our dolls? Yeah. We can dress them up like pilgrims and Indians and then build some houses that look like the houses they used to live in. I'll do squanto. I want to make an Indian baby. I'm going to make a great pilgrimage. Me too. Me three. Me too. Hi, Mama. Hi. You have homework? Mm-hmm. I have to make a pilgrim. And what is a pilgrim? A pilgrim is a person who comes to this country for freedom. Yes, I know what is that. Like us. Time for bed. But, Mama, my pilgrim, you said you would help. I will help. Miss Williams is not going to mind if I finish for you. Okay. Good night. Good night. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Just say good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. You like it? Masha, what is it? But Mama, it does not look like the pilgrim in the book. What do you say? It's beautiful, but it is not a pilgrim. It's you, like in a photograph. What photograph? With Marina Alexandra in dancing dresses. But no, why? Masha. It is not a pilgrim. Don't speak to Masha like that. A pilgrim is someone who came from the other side to find freedom. In Russia, your passport says you're a Jew. Here, your passport says an American. I'm a pilgrim. Your father is a pilgrim. You are a pilgrim. Listen to mother. She knows what she is talking. She work all night on that. I love it. Have a good day, little nose. Fix him. I hope so. Squanto will live. See? Everybody, Squanto lives.
Molly, I thought you might be sick. Sorry, I am late for English. I missed you this morning. Is everything okay? Is there a reason you're late? Well, I hope this won't happen tomorrow morning. Good. I'm glad. Why don't you take your seat? Do you like my cilantro? Where's your dolly, Molly? I used my mom's whole feather duster to make it. Okay, everybody. Bring me your pilgrims and Indians, starting with row one. Oh, nice. A lot of work went into that. Oh, Elizabeth, what a beautiful silk dress. Thank you. I like that nose, Kimberly. Thank Very good. You. Molly, aren't you in row one? not a pilgrim. He's a Russian or foreigner or something. Weird. She did make the right kind of doll. She is beautiful, Molly. But she isn't dressed like a pilgrim. She's dressed like me when I did the dancing in Russia. Perhaps she didn't understand. She's supposed to be dressed like a pilgrim. Mama said. What? Tell me what she said. Go ahead. She said that she's pilgrim and Papa is pilgrim and... And what? I am pilgrim. <laughs> Quiet, children, please. Did you say a pilgrim, Molly? Mama came here for freedom because in Russia it's very hard to be Jewish. So she says she is a pilgrim and I am pilgrim. Okay? Okay. Nobody's a pilgrim anymore. <laughs> now some of you probably understand what Molly is saying. But I'm not sure all of you do. So who would like to explain? Jenny. I think Molly's a new kind of pilgrim because her family came to America for the same reason that the pilgrims did. That's right. Very good. And what reason is that? Someone else. Kate. To be free? That's right. Hmm. <laughs> Arthur, do you have something to add? I think it takes all kinds of pilgrims to make Thanksgiving. I think so, too. Very good, everybody. <laughs> now, does anyone know where the pilgrims got the idea for Thanksgiving? Mm -mm. Elizabeth? They just made it up? They read in the Bible about the Jewish harvest holiday of the tabernacle. Today we call it Sukkot. The pilgrims got the idea for having a feast from Jews like Molly and her mother. Okay, row two, bring up your doll. Your doll is beautiful, Molly. Thank you. Well, good morning. Where's Arthur? Molly, I'm tired. Arthur, stand up. I want to see you. Where are you going, Molly? I want her to stand next to me, Mrs. Okay. Okay, everybody, stand up straight. Look into the camera. Oh, Big smiles. My, picture taken. my hair is. Okay, everybody, let's say oh, cheddar cheese. <laughs> 